Alright guys, Shane here, CryptoFish YouTube channel. So today is the day where we uh, draw the winner for Bitcoin Fridays. Uh, if you're new here, be sure to subscribe, hit that notification icon below the video. Um, and with that, let's hop right in. Let's pick a winner real quick and then we'll go over what my weekly results were for the rig. And um, I'll show you what I'm doing now as far as what coins I'm getting. Alright guys, so be back in a bit. All right, so it was a successful uh, past couple of days. I started out with 580 subscribers, now sitting at 628, so that was good. Welcome those of you who joined the channel here recently in the past couple of days. Um, with that, let's head over to the video. Let's copy this URL. Let's copy it. Go over to the comment picker. Paste that in. Click search. One hundred and seventy three unique. Scroll down a little bit and let's pick a winner, guys. Good luck, everyone. Let's see who we got. Star La. Only Ethereum and Bitcoin Cash are still at a safe level. Well, they're low, but I guess that could be safe. So, congratulations, Star. Let's. Copy your Bitcoin address, pull up my wallet, paste it in here, get rid of that little end brackets, looks good, click send, and send. Alright Star, congratulations again. If you could um, just comment below this video and let everyone know you got it, let me know you got the Bitcoin. and um, Everyone else, don't worry about it. I'll be doing it again next Friday. We're sitting at 628 right now. Once I hit a thousand, that will I will actually be raising the price of Bitcoin Fridays. Um, so that shouldn't be too long off in the future. So again, congrats, Star. Please uh, comment below this video and let me know you got it. All right. So let's pull up last week's stats. So, first off, we lost about 4.9% over the previous week um, as far as amount mined per day. Uh, last week was 51.51, or the week before, and we had 49.02 last week. But we were actually up on total value mined about $15, which is the first time in two weeks. So, that was good news. Um, we ended up doing $49.02 for the week, right at $7 a day between the two rigs. Um, these card, these two cards are still down. So 327 Tron bought last week, 53 Cardano, and $3.84 Bitcoin mine. So now going forward, if you all watched that, if you all watched that uh, portfolio video I did a couple couple weeks ago, I'll link that up above right here. Um, I'm heavily involved in altcoins, but very little Bitcoin. So what I'm doing now, at least for a little while, is I'm going to start building up Bitcoin. So that's what I'm doing. Everything I'm mining now gets converted to Bitcoin. So right now, so far, the past not even really 24 hours, uh, $8.41 on Bitcoin so far. So this AMD rig, it's mining Ethereum, converting it to Bitcoin. This rig, I now have on Awesome Miner, uh, mining Equihash, the various algorithms with that. So let me pull that up. Here it is right here, running. Uh, it says $2.13 a day, but I don't really, um, I don't trust that or follow that because I haven't updated the uh, difficulty with with that algorithm yet. Plus, I have it set up to where it uh, mines the most profitable coin. So if we head over to Mining Pull Hub and look at balances right here, you'll see I've mined Zcash, Zclassic, and Zencash. 
So it's mine three different coins depending on what's the most profitable and then all that gets converted over here to Bitcoin. So this is how much Bitcoin I've converted so far, 0 0.0011. Um, got my um, CPU mining Monero. That is right here on XM Rig. Um, 269 shares accepted so far with that. So all in all, Awesome Miner is doing pretty good. The reason why I'm running Awesome Miner is because last night I had a complete shitstorm with this rig. I was trying to get the 3 gig um, up and running, kind of doing a little finagling. I got it to recognize the 3 gig. Then all of a sudden the drivers got corrupted somehow. I had to strip all the drivers off the computer, load them all back on. Then it wasn't recognizing the 1070 Ti. It just, it just snowballed and snowballed. You guys out there who have Windows rigs, you probably know what I'm talking about. So finally, I got it to recognize the graphics cards, all three of them. But Equihash, or not Equihash, NiceHash would not run. It would not recognize the um, GPUs for whatever reason. So I went into Awesome Miner, fired it up real quick, um, and it recognized two of the three cards so for some reason that three gig which i had running off a riser you would recognize it as far as the windows is concerned but the two miners didn't pick it up so i don't i just stopped fooling with it last night i mean seriously it was like it was over four hours last night i was fooling with this thing so i, I got tired of it i got these two cards up and running um this one right here, GPU Zero, is the 1070 Ti, and this other one here is the 1068 gig gigabyte card. Um, they've been doing pretty good. 2215 accepted, 17 rejected, running for what is that? 17 hours now, 45 minutes roughly. So it's been humming right along with those two cards. I get the power supply tomorrow. And then I'm going to have to get back into it again and try and get that third card up and running. Hopefully it doesn't snowball into a, another nightmare again. But anyways, um, that's that with the NVIDIA rig. So, all in all, I mean, I, I'll just leave it on Awesome Miner. It's, it's not doing bad. But I was I got like two dollars and thirty seven cents on nice hash. It just paid out a little bit ago. So I guess I could just leave that there and keep mining with awesome miner. Eventually, um, I may want to look at the most profitable coin and mine just that. But I like I said, it was four hours last night. I got tired of pulling with it. Once I got it up and running, mining uh, the most profitable coin. I uh, I just left it at that. So, yeah, if I click on Options, Profit Switching, see I selected Mining Pool Hub, and there's my worker, NVIDIA Rig. So that Mining Pool Hub, it's already set up for an NVIDIA GPU. It'll mine the, all the Equihash algorithms, whatever is the most profitable at any given time, which is, which is pretty cool. But I tried to set up this Ethereum pool last night, and it, it wasn't having that for some reason, so... Anyways, that's that. Um, that's what the rigs did last week. 49.02. All in all, not a bad week. I would like to see um, like to see prices go up finally for once. Um, so far this week, we are down about twenty-three dollars off of last week already. That's because all these altcoins are dropping. Bitcoin hasn't dropped too much. We can probably go look at that real quick. This is my, this is what my, um, at 18 cents right there is what my CPU is doing right now. So let's go over real quick. Look at the markets. Bitcoin 7400. Everything's in a red, but it's not too bad. My IOTA is doing pretty good. That's in the green. That's been going up the past couple days. So I'm just hoping. I'm hoping and holding. I think that's what everyone's doing right now. But what I'm really, like I said, focusing on going forward now is just building up Bitcoin. Building up Bitcoin. 
All coins have not been treating me good, so Bitcoin, I'll build that up and cross my fingers, as as with everyone else, I guess. Okay, guys, again, if you didn't win this week, not to worry. I'll be doing it again next week. Um, if you could spread the word, I'd appreciate it. If you guys like the video, hit that like button below. If you guys got any questions or comments, put them below this video. I'll read them all, and I'll get back to you if I can. Okay, guys? So with that, um, I'll be more than likely doing a video tomorrow. So I'll see you all then. Take care, guys. Bye.